Okay, it's starting. Hopefully I don't, to, oh, I don't wanna read these upside down or sideways. Man. What? <laughs> Guys, I have to read these sideways. Why don't you turn it this way? I can't, cause then it's. <sighs> That's why I need my phone with My help. mom's already annoying me. Come on, mom, I gotta be in character a little bit. Hi, everyone. Hmm. Dang it. You don't want to see my setup. Oh, I, why didn't I just put it this way? Here we go. Here we go. I'm going to wait till about 20,000 people sign on if that's okay, guys. Just kidding. Ho, ho, ho! Ho, ho, ho! This hat barely fits me. Thank you, Rar Sawyer 22. I got my makeup done. My mom's eating a croissant. <laughs> Which Bailey got me. It's delicious, of course. And she's choking on it. There's Jacob. Uh, Where are you? Uh, That's my cool nephew. Oh, Joseph wants on too. Uh, there's Joseph. There's Jessica. That's my twin sister. <laughs> you guys know I had a twin? Anyways. <laughs> She's only a few years older. Anyways, uh, my uh, Crooks said, hi, mom. Someone said, hi, Ruby. My name's not Ruby. It's Bailey. <laughs> David Solo says, hi, Anne. Hey, David. Whoop, whoop, David and Whoop. Pepper. <laughs> uh, so, like I said, hello. Thank you, everyone, for joining. Wherever you are all on, wherever you are in the world, I haven't ate anything yet, but I was just going to tell you that I made a very delicious drink for those of you 21 and over or 18 and over if you're in Mexico or something. <laughs> a little bit of coffee. Oh, hi, Ruby. Ruby Soho in the house. Wolf Wolf Aaron Solo in the house. I hope Flex is watching. We got some vanilla, some vanilla vodka. Right. Well, first put coffee. Vanilla vodka, a little bit of fireball, um, some whipped cream, and some ground cinnamon, a little bit of cinnamon powder on there. And you just shake it up, and it's a delicious holiday trizizzy. And that's what we're drinking, me and my mother. Cheers. Cheers. Now. She's my first guest. We're going to talk about all these embarrassing stories. Uh, we're going to start when I was five years old, five months old, five minutes old. What's your first memory of me, Mother, before I start answering these lovely questions? My first memory of you was when I knew I was pregnant with you. Boo! Yay! Boring. Boring. We want another one. We want another one. Well, how about the time I told you recently... When you were three weeks old and I was sitting here holding you in my lap and you turned up and looked at me and, and you I looked said, at me and went, I hate you. <laughs> no. You said, Mom, 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 mom. And then you turned your head and looked back down and I looked up at my mother who was there and I said, She just talked to me, didn't she? And you never stopped talking since. Oh, okay. oh yay. Yep. yay. Funny, funny. Why are people leaving? You guys are you guys wanna see the guests? You guys wanna see some guests that I'm gonna have on? Well, you got three minutes till the first one, okay? Um, I'll answer a couple questions and I'll tell you who the first guest is. So, what do I have for Christmas dinner? Taylor wants to know. Uh, what are we having for Christmas I dinner? Decided, yeah. Sometimes some ham. Uh, we, some tamales. Ideas. We would we made tamales in the past. That's so hard to do. Standing but rib it's roast. Delicious. I don't remember a standing rib roast, but we've done that, I guess. Um, I, I, everything you have for Thanksgiving. I don't know. Um, Barry's just here for me. Shout out, Barry. Woo, woo. 
Babe Caves. Hi, guys. Family Giving Tree. Love you guys. So glad to be doing this. Thank you. Let's ask some questions. Come on. Where where did I get this t-shirt from? Target. Come on. Target. I'm going to have sweat marks by the end of this because I'm drinking coffee and I'm nervous. I'm never going to do a podcast in my life. Okay. Let's ask a couple questions or your time's up because the first guest, let me text him. Where'd I get my hat from? Walmart. It was 98 cents and it barely fits my head. Also, we're not in my, this is, um, it's not a real kitchen. So don't think I'm just hanging stockings in my kitchen. This is, like a, this is my upstairs loft area. That's a mini, mini bar kitchen. It's not my real kitchen, but. Who cares if I had stockings hanging in my kitchen? My, uh, uh, that guy just asked me if I have any pets. Do you follow me? Idiot! Sign off! Oh, hold on. My, um, friend Stone Cold Steve Austin just text me. <laughs> He's not the first guest, so you're going to have to wait. All right. Um, my first guest is going to be who I announced yesterday with all the other five other people. Um, his name is Jeremy Hills. He is an amazing trainer out in Austin, Texas. He just opened up his own gym. And when I lived in, uh, um, thanks NJ Sam's whoop. Thanks for the help dog. Get back to your wedding. Um, when I was living in Austin, I trained at Onnit Academy and I was set up with Jeremy, just a <laughs> freaking Nikki. Um, and I was set up with him because I wanted to be more explosive. I wanted to uh, do better, you know, move better in the ring. And I saw him working with all these amazing athletes. He works with tons of NFL guys, NBA guys, everybody. Um, and he would kill me and he would laugh at it. And uh, he's amazing. And I learned so much from him. So I think that you guys can learn a lot from him, be motivated by him. Um, he just has such a positive outlook on not only in the fitness world or in the gym, but just on life. And you just get a feel good vibe around him. Um, he just opened up his own gym. So I will be training with him for the month of, <laughs> thanks Lala, for the month of January. So you're gonna be seeing a lot of him. So you may as well get to know him now. Let me, um, What was my favorite color as a kid? A uh, family giving tree asked me, so I have to, I think my favorite color was blue. Right now it's purple. My mom says yes, so I guess that was my favorite color. Um, all right, let me text my, my good friend, Jeremy Hills. Oh, he just texted me, we are Unagi, right Jess? Unagi. <laughs> I hope I know how to do this, guys. I hope uh, I will view this request. These are gonna be short conversations, all right? So don't expect like a whole um, podcast thing. This is gonna be a fun five, seven minute thing. And I hope you guys, also we're here for one reason that I didn't even mention. Hey, Ricky, um, I have joined the Family Giving Tree, which is an organization out here in, Bay Area and we want to give to those families that are in need and that are uh, less fortunate than some of us so there's a link in my bio there's a link in my Twitter um, that's what this is all about this is what we're all here for this is what all the guests have agreed to join me for and um, we just want to you know all you have to do is donate some cash donate a gift and there's also if you just click on the cart you can donate a health kit which is a six dollar thing um, it comes with like toothpaste a mask deodorant, all this. It's a very small gesture, but it'll go a long way, trust me. So look, click on the link in my bio and please, whatever you can do to help will be very much appreciated. You guys have been doing amazing so far. I'm so blown away by this. It is, it is like you're reaching my goals and beyond. I have to keep raising it. All right, two minutes for him to come on. So I got a couple, a couple more minutes to, uh, my favorite Christmas movies. I gotta say Elf because my sister's yeah. here. <laughs> Elf for sure. Um, I love Santa Claus with Tim Allen. Um, yeah, Ricky, you better donate. Um, 
Uh, what's that one? What's the one with uh, Arnold Schwarzenegger? Oh, was it Jingle it? All the Way. Jingle All the Way. Yeah. They're just classics. Just that one. Classics. Okay. You guys want to know how nice I am? I got bagels for everyone this morning. And also, I forget what they're called. Barn. Gingerbread house, a gingerbread barn. Hey, Seth, <laughs> I miss you. <laughs> I miss you. Oh my God, what a guy, what a guy. Anyway. Um, people are asking how my knee is, um, so my knee is doing great, my leg's doing great, my ankle's doing great, my calf is doing great, my shin is doing great, my hip is doing great, um, my mind is doing great, so, I mean, it's only a matter of time, I'm not gonna tell you when, and I don't want all these idiots watching to know when, but, um, I'm gonna be coming back soon, maybe, you know, and y'all better be ready. Better be ready. All right. Now let's, okay. Oh, let's hope that I will see this request. View. Request to join. Gosh, there's, can you guys stop requesting to join? It's, there's only five people, that, six people that are allowed, okay? <laughs> this is what's, <clears throat> I can't even see it. Uh-oh. <clears throat> Let's see here. Jay Hill, if you're watching, I'm trying, okay? I might have to call my social media guy to help me. Nikki, where are you at? You still watching? I'm hitting a few requests for everything. You guys are making me mad. Do, 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 do. Don't worry, I'm gonna ask you guys questions too, okay? Just be patient. What does this mean? All right, I'm calling in my friend. Oh, there he is. Thanks, Jay Hills. I'll figure this out, dude. I knew this was gonna happen. So you guys are gonna say hello to my little friend who's at a wedding. Hey Nikki, you're live. How do I do? You have your shirt off. God, this guy is getting out of control. Hey, so do I click on this view request thing, right? Yeah. I'm so sorry to. <laughs> Nothing comes up though. So are, are people? Do you see people? Uh, asking to join? Yeah. I mean, but it's like a looks like a block of people. See view request. Like block of, uh, class. Hold on, it's loading. Uh huh. Uh, but then it just goes blank. Don't tell me I'm gonna have to restart this. You, uh, you may. Do you know? Um, is your first guest ready and already asking? Yeah, he's ready. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just trying to see a way in which we can fix this. Um... It's Nikki, guys. You guys read WWE Twitter? You guys hate what gets tweeted? Instagram? Wait till I call the merch guy next and yell at him. Restart it. Yeah, I would say I mean, it's probably best to restart. I, I don't. So, yeah. and, if, and everyone you and everyone you've asked is following you, right? Yeah, I hope so. If this yeah, happens to Stone Cold, I'm screwed. Oops, sorry. Yeah, I would say that's the one. That's the one that I would make sure that everyone who's following you look great. Right uh, Thank you. He said I look great. Uh, everyone's that, that's the first time everyone who's following. You. Uh, everyone that you're following and wants to go live with you can see you following. Yeah, they are. And then, um, All right, like, can you give me four minutes to look it up and I'll be back? Yeah, so should I just stay on? 
I mean, I'll just answer questions. All right, guys. Sorry, Jeremy. All right. You guys miss me? How do we get here? I used to know you so well. They're really getting a treat here. Okay. Thanks, dog. Sorry. Bye. The office or new girl? That is a very tough question, but if you're paying attention mm -hmm. and you read my post yesterday, which it doesn't seem like you did or else you would know because I put in my post that it was my favorite show, Winston from New Girl is going to join us today. Today, so I hope you got your bird shirt on. Sorry, Jay Hills. I, I swear, why can't I? Re remove from live? No. Go live with Jay Hills. Can I just do that? Let's see if this worked. Let me see. Hey, Jay Hills, can you click, um, see if it pops up on your thing that I requested you? Yeah! Hey. We did it! I'm there we go. I did it better than my social media guy. Yeah, you did. We Listen, him. you might have found your next career. I know. No, I don't want to be a social media person. <laughs> no just mind. kidding. Just kidding. I'd be good at it. Thank you so That's much fine. for coming on. Thank you for waiting. Yeah, no problem at all. No, I, listen, I, I was listening to you try to figure it out, and I was like, yeah, I'm glad this wasn't on me. Because I don't know how to do it either. So. For real, that's what I was so nervous about. And I was messaging. I had just FaceTimed him earlier. Like, I didn't even know how to go live. I right. thought I'd click on my little story and it'll pop up as an option. But I had to, like, slide to the left and all this stuff. So. And do a whole bunch of other stuff, too, right? All, all yeah. these people people think you're good looking, huh? Guys, back off, okay? He's here to talk serious oh. stuff. Oh, but, thank you, guys. Yeah, that's, that's very nice of you. Yeah, I, I'll take that because it's, it's allergy season right now here in Austin, and I feel... Oh, my gosh. Yeah. I remember that. Yeah. So I want to introduce you to my mom real quick, Jer. Hi. Hi. I called you Jer because my, my hey. brother's name is Jeremy. So. There we go. There we go. Yeah. We got yeah. close. That's right. He's, yeah, <laughs> thanks for taking care of my girl here. Listen, I literally cannot wait to have her back just from... I want her to see the new facility. I want her to meet the team. Uh -huh. The, like everybody that's going to be around her to support her on this comeback journey and then nice. she's obviously going to go kick everybody's ass we know that already so it's right. like, yeah that's right yeah that's let's, right. let's uh, and when you're do our done part. with her i can't wait to get her back here oh yes ma'am for sure for she's sure. Gonna, she'll miss me but i told her all about you and, yes. and everything so yeah. everyone's excited but um, there we go yeah i'm so happy that you're on i know you're super busy um you got your new facility collective that just opened up. Is it open to the public or what? So it's not open to the public yet. Um, we'll be open, um, you know, next month, actually. It's been a journey, as you know, right? As long as yeah. we've been there, it's been a journey. So I'm excited about it. But um, yeah, no, it's we're this close. And I'm like telling everybody, just give me a couple more weeks. Let me roll this out to you the right way. Yeah. If you guys, uh, everybody watching, if you guys check out his um, Instagram, Hills 5 yeah, there we go. At okay. Jay Hills 5, and you can follow uh, at Collective Inc. Yeah. Or is it? Yep. See? Yeah. Look, right. I'll tell you I what. I gave myself, like, props. I'm like, you. No, you um, did it. You did it. It is, like, the coolest facility if you are an athlete or if you're someone that is looking into just getting into working out or what. I don't know. He has everything, and he you work with all kinds of athletes, so I'm so excited. That's why I, I'm not even, like, I was talking to my surgeon about it. Um, he was a little concerned about me going. He's like, you know, just make sure they know your limitations. Like, don't don't go full throttle right away. And I'm like, dude, don't worry about it. I just, it's more of the mentality that, that I was telling you uh, earlier is whenever I trained with you, you just had that, that mentality maybe from training with so many athletes or being an athlete yourself, you know, that you've kind of gone through the process and the grind and everything, that, which really helped me all the time and just... I felt like I always wanted to impress you too, which is always good to have a coach where you're, you you want to be as good as, or, you know, and, you know, just try to, that you can look up to. So I really, really uh, enjoyed it, even though I wasn't as good as uh, I shared videos when I lived in Austin. I'm sure so many people saw, um, uh, I was really bad at a lot of the things. The thing is this, is that like, 
I don't know if you realize how athletic you are. I still don't know if you realize that. Like, no, I'm serious. I'm serious. <laughs> like, I would throw certain stuff at you just to kind of see how you would respond. And and it's like your adaptation, the way that you like pick up on something so quickly. And then, I mean, you're you're a bit of a perfectionist, which is I've never been around a great athlete that isn't. So it's like yeah. the way that you would dial in and say, okay, where am I at? Where do I need to be? And then by the time we do whatever it is again, I'm like, man, it's night and day. She, she's, oh. we continue to add on and stack on and stack on and, and then progress happens. So no, I'm excited about that. You tell your surgeon too, that we have a <laughs> medical team that will give you a, the, the evaluation before we ever even get into the fun stuff. So yeah. My mommy will be glad to hear that. She's happy that she's smiling now. That's perfect. Yeah. I, <laughs> As much as I would like to act like it's all about me and I know what I'm doing and this, that, and the third, listen, I listen to them. When they tell me we can do something, we will. And if they say not yet, then it's not yet. So. Yeah, I love it. Once you said you had like therapists out there, I'm like, yep, I'm, yep. I'm good. I'll be in good hands. Yep. Yeah. So uh, one thing that I wanted to um, like the, for the fans that are watching, these are going to be quick little uh, interviews here and there. And again, we're just trying to get some uh, traction to the link that's in my bio for family giving tree to donate to kids and um, families that are in need. So thank you so much, Jeremy, for coming on. It means a lot. It's uh, this is my first time doing it. So it's really cool to, to just, you know, have different people involved and people I look up to. But um, one of the main things, so everybody watching, um, come on, come on, Joe. My nephew. My nephew's actually an athlete. Maybe you can train him sometime. He trains hey, guys. Let's go. In NBA guys too. Let's go. He, 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 he said, "Do you train Stephen Curry?" <laughs> <laughs> Not, he lives out here. Right? Yeah, he I wish. I wish. Tell him make the introduction for me though. I yeah. wish. <laughs> um, so one of the things I, I talked to you that I wanted to mention to everybody watching was every every time I go on your story, it's like 3 a.m. 4 a.m., 6 a.m., whatever it is, whatever time you get up or whatever, you haven't gone to sleep yet. Um, right. you, your quote that you use is win the day. And you don't type anything else, just win the day, and you type in the, the time. you know. And I remember watching a video of you that you posted to your Instagram, just kind of explaining what that meant to you and how that helps you mentally and how it helps your athletes. So um, for any athletes watching or people that might need a little boost of motivation, inspiration, I was wondering if you could kind of share your, your – yeah. uh, so the funniest thing is like in the beginning, so I've been doing that now for I say probably five or six years consistently, right? Where mm -hmm. like in Of course when it gets good. <laughs> <laughs> the internet doesn't want to know. Right. It, you know Are we what? Back? Are we good? The universe doesn't want want you to share your secret. Are we good? There we go. We're good. There oh, I'm go. sorry. Okay. No, what, what I was saying is in the beginning, so in the beginning, it was more so me talking to myself. Like I needed to get going because I was having to be up at like four in the morning, 4.30 in the morning consistently because I was training from like 5 a.m. to to 9 p.m. consistently, right? And, and uh, not even, there's a couple of people that know this. I don't even know if I told you this, is that like, so my very first facility was next to uh, an aquarium and they would feed snakes and mice don't like to be eaten. They don't want to be food. So they like, we would have to like lay out traps at night and then get to the facility like 45 minutes before it opened be because chances are we're going to have the mice that didn't, you know, get eaten by the snakes that, that night. So I was having to get to the facility by like 4.45, 5 a.m. so that I could clean up before we opened. And, uh, clean up like dead mice? Yeah. Oh, my God. Yeah. So uh, with, with that, it was like, I mean, this is at that point in time, that was a part of my day. That is a part of where I am currently at. And it's like, I'm either going to, you know, bitch and complain about it or I'm going to set my mentality to to win today, win today. And then, like, I had all these goals. I had written down, like, what does my five year, my 10 year look like? What does my quarter look like? What does my week look like? And And only for me to finally realize, like, none of that matters unless I take care of Monday. And then if I take care of Tuesday 
And, and so as I started to narrow my focus, like what started out as me just talking to myself, motivating myself, people would write me all the time and be like, I look forward to seeing this post in the morning. It gets me going. And I'm like, all right, yeah, we all in it together then. Let's win the, <laughs> let's win the day. Let's, let's, yeah. let's make up our mind to do the mundane, daily, boring, detailed task so that we can end up exactly where we want to be. Wow. Yeah, that's, and to, to think when you wake up, like, you know, most of us wake up and, you know, you want to get your workout out of the way or people who do empty stomach cardio, you wake up and you're like, oh, I really don't want to do that. I don't want to get out of bed to do that, but I know I have to. Like, imagine waking up and knowing you have to clean up dead mice right <laughs> before you even could yeah. start the stuff that you is hard already. Oh. You know? oh, what a time. It was fun. It was, it was a lot of fun. It was, yeah. yeah. <laughs> You definitely nice earned, you earned your days for sure too. Definitely. Yeah. Well, that was a. Uh, um, I feel like I, I can't remember where I heard it or who I heard it from, but it was um, you know how, as many people as there are in the world and how different we are from each other and whatever it is we're all going through. It's like we can all relate in the struggle because everybody has struggles. You know, that's like the one common thing that people can relate to. We're all, and it, it may have been when I was, had first started with WWE because with the, the, it was like a camp style that we were doing, you know, and it was, we were all literally going through the same exact thing. We go home and we live different lives and we all have different characters, but everything we were going through, we were going through together. So it brings people closer. So I feel like with the win the, win the day quote, when someone sees that in the morning and that's how it caught my attention too, it was like, yeah. He's up at 4 a.m. and you know, he's like, like everything that you're, and I met you and you're already doing, you know, training all these guys and like, it's such a, you're already up here, but like you keep getting higher and higher and it's just like having that mentality. And uh, for me, it really helped. So I hope people watching it helped a lot too. And I hope uh, somebody takes something away from this. And um, yeah, I'm really, I'm really glad that you joined me because I can't wait. What, what's the date today? It is uh, the 11th. Yeah. So, how many more? How many weeks do we have like two 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 and a half or three two and a half weeks and it's and, yeah. and we're doing this in person at that yeah point. i gotta i gotta text you so we can figure out a schedule i already got my massages my chiropractor and my stretching all sorted out so um yeah we'll be hanging out soon and then we can share with everybody my progress i love it i love yeah. it and i that's the that is the piece where you know what i'm gonna say next right it's like you have to fall in love with the process yeah fall in love with the process like we we're, we're so married to the end result we'll get there but yeah. you know uh pun intended let's win the day let's let's yep. fall in love with, with the actual process let's let's see what, what where progress takes us and then at the end of the day we'll be exactly where we're supposed to be yep hell yeah well i'm so excited thank you so much for joining me i appreciate it i know you got a beautiful daughter to get to so i hope you guys All have right. I, I apparently passed down allergies to her and this is all right now i'm sharing a little bit much i didn't know little babies don't know how to sneeze i mean they don't know how to blow their nose so, <laughs> i was gonna say sneeze okay. oh, wait wait this didn't, all right so they don't know how to blow their nose so i called her doctor this morning because she kept throwing up and i was like what's going on it's like yeah so since they don't know how to blow their nose it just sits in their stomach so oh. he's basically Nothing's wrong with her, but get ready. It's going to be a long day. I was like, okay. So you do a lot of the, like, draining of the nose? The yeah. Little... Okay. Get in there and, and get it. So, yeah, I'm over here having a blast. I'm having Well, your, your baby's throwing up, and you still join me in teaching all of us how to win the day. So I appreciate you even more. Always. Love. Thank you, love. Jeremy. I appreciate you. Week. Yes, for sure. I'll send you a text and thank you everyone for watching and thank you, Jeremy, so much. I'll talk to you soon. See you soon. Bye. Bye, mom. Bye. <laughs> See you soon, Bye. maybe in Texas. <laughs> He's gone. He's gone. <laughs> All right. Well, gosh, good thing I'm a genius. Thanks for watching, guys. No, go ahead. Okay. My sister's going to make espresso and you're going to deal with it. It's loud or not because you're watching. Let me text my next guest and see if he is already because it's a little later than I said. Wait, no, it's not. I know what I'm doing. You want me to answer some questions while we're, uh, oh, this is perfect. I said 1130. 
Nespresso. Hey, wait. I got this little. The, like the house that I still like. Oh, it sets up. Or it, it lights up. Yeah. So the move your move your peach box. Oh. I hope you guys enjoyed that because Jay Hills is very important to me. So it better be important to you. Um, tap on the link in my bio. Do some donations, and I'm going to tell you how to win the painting that I posted in my Instagram yesterday or the day before. Um, I'll be sharing that once I get the artist on. He will be around noon. So uh, I'll let you know how you can win that because it's beautiful. Uh, all right, let me answer a couple questions. And go. And go. What's my favorite thing to do in the Bay Area or about the Bay Area? Honestly, the people are the favorite, my most favorite thing about the Bay Area. No offense to everybody around the world, but I've done a lot of meet and greets. Um, and I've, I, I know a lot of people working with them and stuff. And I just have such a good connection with Bay Area people. I don't know what it is. Um, it's just, it's, it's hard to explain, but if you're from here, you get it, you know? Uh, we like to say hella, and we like to get hyphy. <laughs> we like to get hyphy, and we do the fizz dance, okay? <laughs> we should have had who on here? All right, if anyone comes to the Bay Area, what's some good tour spots? Honestly, you want to check out a lot of the food. Um, I said this on my 49ers YouTube thingy. Uh, iguanas and La Vix. Amazing Mexican, Mexican food. If you're here during the holidays, go check out Christmas in the Park downtown, um, which we need to go to. What? Yes. Buena Vista. My mother said Buena Vista. It's in San Francisco. Uh, it's, if you like Irish coffees, that's the spot to go to. But also we just <laughs> found out like a year ago or something. We have been going there for years and we just found out one year ago that they have amazing food. Uh, just amazing food. It's so good. Uh, I was going to turn this on. Ow. You can't even see it. Well, a light went on there. All right, ask me a couple more questions. Let me text our next guest. What type of tamales did we make? Um, no, uh, what what, pork, like, carnitas. Pork, carnitas. Uh, we made uh, vegan for Jeremy the one vegan year. Vegan for my brother. And cheese and jalapeno. And cheese and jalapeno. And uh, <laughs> the sweet ones, but all the sweet ones. Here, Peter great. loved those ones. Of course he did. <laughs> The saint said, I'm okay, Bailey, and he spelt my name wrong. Whatever that means, learn how to spell my name. All right. My favorite song as, oh, it is. Let's it's all see. Lit up now. see the house? It wasn't like that before, but once you fill it with coffee, it lights up. Beautiful. Oh. What Christmas movie are we watching? It's a uh, wonderful line. It's a Christmas story. story. Oh, Christmas oh. story. Christmas story. What oh, Christmas are some story. of your guys' favorite Christmas uh, movies? Hey, Sammy Zane. Yes, you missed Jay Hill, Dion. Come on. He was the first one. Win the day. You got to start the day with Jay Hills. He's the man. The man. Go back and watch it, okay? I'm going to need people to start coming on a little more. Come on, guys. You know who else I have on here? Stone Cold Steve Austin! Uh, Winnie the Bish. I have um, a Home Alone. Sorry, I asked you guys a question. Die Hard. Dana, I hate you. Die Hard is not a Christmas movie. Idiot. Hi, Sammy. Hey, I really, hotel, I'm really um, upset with what Brock Lesnar did to you uh, last night. It really made me mad. I hope you're feeling okay. I feel your pain. I was in a wheelchair too. Christmas Story and Home Alone 2. That's good. That's good. There's no elves. There's no elves out there. My sister's going to be mad. Did anyone say Christmas Story? The Grinch. The Grinch. Yeah, they said Christmas Story. Oh. The no. Grinch. What? Vacation. Christmas vacation. Oh, Christmas Vacation. Yeah, that's my National favorite. Lampoon. Yeah. Uh, that's fun. Go Brazil. Oh, the chocolate ones are good. Mm -hmm. Let me give a shout out to Siete. Mm -hmm. Siete. Mm -hmm. They're not watching this, but they send some very generous um, 
I have donations and tortillas. <laughs> Love actually. Sammy Zane said his feelings are hurt worse than his neck, but he's going to make a big comeback. So any of you guys that are concerned, Sammy Zane is just fine. Um, you send Brock a message that if I see him, I'm going to untie his shoelaces. Mm -hmm. Okay. Sammy Zane underneath loves those things. Huh? Underneath the table, me and Brynn used to do Oh, that. yeah. Underneath the table, my sister's giving me tricks. Mm -hmm. My twin sister. Mm -hmm. Hey, remember um, when it was, like, really popular when you guys found out who my sister, my other sister was? And um, you guys were like, oh, my God, Bailey's sister's so hot. Why doesn't she work for WWE? Yes, that was nice. <laughs> they found Brenda. She is hot. You got, the, you got the other. Um, let me share a story because uh, I'm waiting for a response real quick. I asked Trish Stratus to join us tonight, today. And unfortunately, she had other uh, commitments to her children. So I had to, um, <laughs> I guess I had to understand. Her kids are very important and there's a birthday party to go to. She had to be a mom, whatever. Mm -hmm. So Trish, you're watching this. I don't know. She just sent me a text message. So she says she owes me. So we're going to do, uh, um, we're going to do this again one time. It's just going to be me and Trish and you guys are going to be really annoyed at how we talk to each other. Cause it's, a, it's, uh, it's kind of annoying and a lot of banter. All right. I might just ask a, uh, someone else to come on and see if they're ready. So while I wait for, um, prank Sinatra, Anybody who knows, knows. So let's go to our next one, which will be, let me get my notes out. <laughs> oh, 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 actually. I'm going to ask uh, Vic Fuentes. Vic from Pierce the Veil. Were you honest when you said I could never leave your bed? Wake me up and let me know you're alive. You guys like my makeup? I got it done just for you. Costs a lot of money. So go to the link in my bio. <laughs> send a gift, send a health kit. It's only $6. Or you can donate any type, any amount of money. Anything is greatly appreciated. Let's give these people um, a great Christmas yeah. because honestly, come on, this is like the best Christmas present you could ever have is what is going on right now. Right. You're welcome. Mm -hmm. My mom's watching it on her phone even though she's sitting no, right next to, to me. I was trying to get the link. I was trying to get the link. I'm just kidding, just kidding. She's so sweet. <laughs> All right, so Vic okay. looks like, it looks like Vic's gonna be the next guest. So get your microphones ready, get your guitars ready. Ooh. My guitar is out of tune, but I might play a little sum sum for you guys. Oh, yeah. Oh, you want to get it for me? Yeah. 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 Thank you. I'm getting my guitar. Oh, good. I don't have, I thought you sent me Oh, my cousin Melissa's on here. She says, hi, mom. Jessica's here too. Hi, Melissa. Um, yeah, I Melissa, you should have been here. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> she wants to know if you saw her coffee mug. Sure. She's going. Well, she, well, it doesn't. Well, cause they turn it around. Yeah. There we go. There we go. I invited Lights Melissa up. and the girls, but she's working. Yeah. Go pay your bills. <laughs> she says, hi. All right. Jink. Or, no, no. Thank you. you email? Say hi, Joe. This is Joseph. <laughs> Lala says hi too. Aww. Hello. Ooh. Um, Lala says you're way cooler than me. <laughs> I'm better than Elias Samson. All right, Vic's gonna log on. And I'm going to have to do what I did with him and Jay Hills. I mean, with Jay Hills, which is click on his comment and Did ask you, him to join. This is the 
Jojo. Oh, you guys want Jojo. Sasha? I don't care. Brianne's on. Hey, all my friends that are commenting. <laughs> yeah, I could play Neo on the car, on the guitar. And it's all because of you. And it's all because of you. There you go. Want to, but I can't help it. I can't get nothing done. Only concern is. There you go. Thanks to whoever requested Neo. How'd you know I love him? Is it the guy from the bar that played Neo on the um, thing? <laughs> What's it called? Jukebox. Juke, juke, jukebox. Juke, 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 J U K E, J U K J U K E, not K E, J U K E, jukebox, right? Hey guys, is it jukebox? What were you saying? <laughs> I, I thought it was maybe jukebox. Juke? No, juke? I, <laughs> jukebox. <laughs> no, maybe not. And my sister doesn't have anything to drink. It's just, it's just all your brain functions. She likes to make words up. Oh, dang. Jukebox. Oh, dang. No, sit down, Jody. Um, I just learned that there's an hour cap on this. <laughs> so how long have I been doing this? When did I start? Ten almost years ago. Almost an hour? Ten years ago. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so let me, uh, so before we get on our next guest. Oh, thank you. Did you uh, add it to the cart? Before we get on our next guest, I am going to restart this because mm -hmm. apparently I only have an hour. <gasps> so thanks for the heads up. I talk too much. You guys ask too many questions. I'll be right back. Come back on, please. I miss you.